We all know the drill. Take Sam Raimi's Evil Dead horror movies, turn them into a musical with a book, Music and Lyrics, by George Weinblatt, Frank Cipolla, Melissa Morris, and Christopher Bond. Give it to director Justin Bean, music director Jennifer Buchheit, and choreographer Sam Gage, plus assorted actors, designers, and technicians to put it all on the stray dog stage. And you have a gentle, refined evening of theater somewhere else. Here we have those five college kids off for a weekend in a remote cabin, of course, which harbors an ancient book of the dead, of course, with mysterious formulas that the kids fiddle with, of course, which releases the resident Kandarian demons, DBA the Evil Dead, of course, who turn the kids one by one into Kandarian demons themselves. Obviously, cast, crew, and audience all have their tongues firmly in their cheeks. But how far in? Too far and you lose the thrill. Not far enough and you lose the laughs. Scenic designer Josh Smith, costume designer Eileen Engel, lighting designer Tyler Dino, and makeup designer Sarah Castelli all provide the needed landmarks of the horror film. The menacing trees outside the rambling rustic cabin, the chainsaw attacking the demonic hand which then roams about the room, the possessed girlfriend whose severed head now rests on a shelf, all cleverly and obviously fake but with resonance. The actors are variously successful in getting the tongue in the right place. Kristen Ringhausen has lots of comic energy as the sister of the leader of the group and the first to be seized by demons. Riley Dunn keeps the right degree of control as Ash, the leader who has set it all up. Don Schmid plays his sweet girlfriend. Stephen Henley, his crude buddy. Janelle Gilrath, his sexpot date. Maria Bartolotti shows up as the daughter of the cabin's owner. Corey Frayne as her meek boyfriend, Josh Douglas as the local country bumpkin, and hero of the splatter zone as he moves down the road, spraying them with fake blood, and Kevin O'Brien as the ghostly owner of the cabin and of the Book of the Dead. It is what it is, and you know if Evil Dead the Musical is what you want. Well, Bob, I managed to get my hands on that Kandarian Book of the Dead you mentioned. Would you like to hear some of it? I would, but first let's hear some music from this show. Thank <laughs> you. 